Hi, this is Don Campbell, and thanks for watching this Expand to Web screencast. Today I'd like to show you a really cool new feature in WordPress 2.8 that allows you to upload a new theme to your blog or your website without having to use FTP. Using FTP or file transfer protocol was a huge stumbling block for a lot of people, especially people new to the web or new to blogging or building websites, because it required you to go download a client piece of software. Um, add your credentials to your host and log into your host and copy files into the right place and, and this new feature eliminates all of that. So let's go take a look at how it works. So this is a fresh WordPress install. haven't done anything to it yet. I just set it up and I'm going to go log into the admin panel and you're going to see the dashboard. Now what I'm interested in here is going to the appearance section on the left hand side. This is where I can select themes for my blog. Now WordPress comes with a couple of default themes. What we're going to do is go add a new theme. So I'm going to click Add New Themes here. And this is the new feature. Basically I can search the WordPress themes library for a whole bunch of free themes out there. If I have my own theme, for example the Small Biz WordPress theme that I want to upload, now I can upload it directly from this panel instead of having to go get an FTP client and do all that configuration. So I'm going to go upload choose file and I'm gonna go grab the zip file that contains the theme and click install now and WordPress is going to automatically unpack that theme and put it into the directory on my server for me once this is done it'll give me a chance to activate the theme so here I can preview and activate the theme I'm just going to click activate here and just like that my new theme is active now for the WordPress or for the small biz theme the first thing you want to do is go to the Small Biz Options panel. And this is because when you go there, it triggers uh, uh, some script that automatically creates your first few pages for you. So you want to at least go touch the Options panel. And by the way, this is where you can change all of the information about your business and the map and your business hours and what shows up on the home page and everything. So it's one of the cool things about the Small Biz theme, I think, is the ability to make all those changes. If I go take a look at my site, here it is. So I've activated the theme, all my pages have been created, and now I can go in and customize the theme and do whatever I want with it. So thanks for watching, and I hope this helps you um, style your, your blog or website a lot easier than you might have been able to before. Take care.